What's up, Castle Clash Hirsch here, and guess what, guys? I am on the account of the first ever Ares hero in our server. This is the Ares that belongs to Kahar, one of my very good friends on Castle Clash. We've been talking for months and months. We've known each other for a long time. He's the one who's done all my artwork for YouTube, for the forums, everything. This guy is the one who designed this hero and won the artwork contest for this Ares hero. He designed Ares. And this is the first Ares. It was sent to him by IGG for winning that contest. So congratulations, Kahar. I am so happy for you winning this Ares. That is so awesome. And you you really have no idea how proud I am that uh, I got to be help, uh, help you win this, um, you know, supporting you and throwing out the YouTube video shout outs to try and gain support for you. And uh, so glad that I could be a part of that whole thing and see you get Aries in the end. That is just so amazing. This has been a long awaited for thing. Uh, Kahar is in Guild Indonesia. This is his own guild. Um, he It's really just for Indonesian players. So if you are Indonesian and you're looking for a good top guild to be a part of, this is a great uh, guild to come to. Kahar absolutely amazing man and this is his guild you can see here uh, he's very artistic he's made the aries symbol down here with out of these letters and real cool to see there just awesome awesome i'm so excited to show you guys this guys he has got the first ever uh aries in the game and we can go ahead and take a look and see what he's got with it you can see that it's already eight star yeah he was ready for it Seven of nine, two five revive is what he has so far. Let's uh, pop over to my albums or my pictures, um, and we can take a look at it. You, here you can see, uh, maybe if it'll come up, there it is. This is him receiving the reward. First thing, as soon as the server came back online, he got the reward. There it is. Kahar's Ares, yeah. Check it out. Ares born three heroes by 120%. Attack reduces their energy by 20 and disables their skills for one second. Cooldown is seven seconds long. So here we're going to just walk through these screenshots and you can see each level that he took them. Taking it to level 20, 40, 60, 80, 100, 120, 140, and 145. So then of course the next step is going up the skills. 2 of 9, 4 of 9, 5 of 9, 6 of 9... Seven of nine, and there he sits. And you can see he started rolling talents there too. Uh, got the four five deadly strike after the sprint. So pretty cool. Um, we're gonna bounce back over there. Hopefully it didn't take. We weren't away for too long. Come on, ah, oh, we were. That's all right. <laughs> I hate having to wait for it to load. So usually I try and be quick, but evidently I wasn't quick enough. But anyways, guys, so yeah, we're on Ares. Uh, we've got 2,000 gems we can do a couple rolls with for talent, and we can play around uh, with Ares in the different aspects of the game. We can do some arena with him. We can do some dungeons with him and just play around with it. So let's uh, make sure we've got magic, and then I'm going to do a couple rolls and then head to the dungeon. Yeah, dungeons. I want to see Ares in the dungeons. So there you go. Reroll. Oh, change, and we got the new rolling system, so this is pretty cool. Um, first roll looked like stone skin. We don't want that, so let's re-roll. Yes, 1-5 berserk. Don't want that. 1-5 scatter, no thanks. And let's go ahead and bounce out of there because those are just popping up with 1-5s. Go take a look at the dungeon and see Ares in action. Gonna hit that 40 shard dungeon. Actually, we want to go to the 37 shard dungeon, don't we? That tends to be the one where we can see the difference in everything that goes on. There we go. And we're just gonna tank. I'm just gonna drop everything, tank pumpkin duke, just like I would usually do. Um, we'll see. Drop there. Get the frenzy going. And look, look at that. Oh, that is so grody looking. So cool too, though. I bet you could almost tank Ares without magic and watch him stop that spirit mage from proccing. Yeah. I bet you don't even need shield. That was so cool looking though. Oh my god. Uh, kind of scary looking. I like it. I like it a lot. Alright, roll a couple more times. 
I want to see if we got some backup heroes that need good talent. Well, it's 5-5 five, five Revive. He, he definitely doesn't need a good talent. Um, so what do these druids have? 3-5 Scorch. Okay, so they could use a good talent if we roll one. I'm just thinking with the new top, with the new system, who would we want to give what to? 4-5 Berserk. We definitely would want to keep him. We got some 4-5s, some 5-5 five, five Heavy Blow going on there. So if we roll like a high Berserk or a high Revite, we'd probably want to put it on that Pumpkin Duke. 5-5 five, five Berserk Snowzilla. Pumpkin Duke could have used that talent. All right, so let's go ahead and roll. Change roll. No 1-5. We don't want that. 4-5 Tenacity. Yeah, we could put it on a Might Raising Hero. Right, we got Paladin. Mino has 4-5 War God. 2-5 Heavy Blow. 2-5 Slow Down. Eh. Yeah, we'll just put it on a Might Booster. I don't want to waste it. There you go. Replace. Boom. Okay, re-roll. 5-5 five, five Heavy Blow. We'll stick that on Ares for now. Better than 2-5 Revite, or do we want to keep Revite? I guess Ares, we really only want Revite. Who would be great for Heavy Blow? I want to change that. What's this Ninja have? 3-5 Slow Down? A Ninja with Heavy Blow could be really, really useful. Oh, there we go. Emortep is 2-5 Heavy Blow. Let's do that one. Give him a good talent. All right. So back to Ares. Reroll. I really like this new system. Don't want the Scorch. 2-5 Revite is what we have already. And that's it. Oh, that's the last of our gems. Oh, shit. I didn't even realize it went by that fast. That's too bad. <laughs> With that new system, it could get real easy because it doesn't... You don't leave the... You don't leave the screen, so you don't realize that uh, you run out of gems or you go through gems as fast. It is a lot easier to go through gems really fast than that one, than that talent system. Wow, definitely watch out for that, guys. Um, either way, that talent system, hell of a lot better than the old talent system. The only reason why I'm mad about it is because we didn't have it this whole time, and I have spent thousands of dollars on talent rolls. Oh, well, at least we won't have to worry about that. All right, I'm probably going to kill him by doing this, but let's try it. I want to see if I can just frenzy this bitch and keep that spirit mage from proccing. So here we go. Frenzy. Nope, not going to work. Oh, we lost Pumpkin Duke. Oh, that was a terrible idea. Oh, well, we'll still win it at least. Wow. I don't know whose damage that was that just killed that, whether that was Mino or what, but that was crazy. Now, does he affect buildings? Does he hit buildings with a proc at all? I don't think he does. So that might be like one downside of Ares is he's only against heroes. Because I'm not seeing like him really do any long-range damage to any heroes. Maybe. Was that Helm right there? Or was that Mino again and I just didn't notice? Hmm. Interesting. Alright, so let's go ahead and try Here Be Monsters. Um, I'm not sure which Here Be Monster we're doing. It looks like we've won H before. We haven't won H before. I don't know why. We have Town Hall 18. Kahar. I want to fix your base up, bro. I want to fix your base up. I don't know what these are exit okay yeah i don't want to mess with that i want to fix your base so that we can farm here be monster h although it really is should be farmable as is you've got a good base design hmm let's move these buildings over here and not do this wrap around thing i don't like that Go like that, 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 just like that. Sorry for fucking with your base, Kahar. But I bet you we can do H now if we make your base an H base. And we can simply do that by this little trick right here. Da -da -da -da. One more, come on. Well, how come we don't match it? Oh, there we go. Missed one. Oh, well, we'll leave it there. Fine. Like that. Okay, cool. So now we've got an H base by taking off the top and bottom. 
And let's give it a try. We want Spirit Mage. We want ranged heroes over there. So you go over there. Cupid and Druid are fine in there. All right, here we go. See what we can do. Go, here be Monsters H. Come on, Ares, show us your might. Copter's coming in. See, we're getting this good split. This is exactly why we wanted the base or the base on the outside to look like that. It's because we'll end up splitting up the heroes like this. Come on, Mino, give us a good proc. Or Ares. All right, Ares is all sorts of revited up right now, ready to go. And here comes some good little. These guys are going to be awesome, and they're going to go make Ares proc as long as they survive long enough to get up there. They're not going to survive long enough. Damn it. <laughs> oh, well. Oh, cool. So we got this druid all revited up, ready to proc. So I guess here we're going to see Ares stop that druid from procking and therefore keep them from living. Just massive. Good, good stuff right there. Those dragons will get swept up real easy by Spirit Mage and Druid. And we're not going to have a problem with H1 at all. H2 is coming in. And again, we're going to get some good splits here, hopefully, if all goes well. Should see a split right here when they destroy these two. These dragons are going to split into two groups. Oh, Ares just demolishing them from long range. Heroes are dead. That druid barely survived. Wow. I think we're definitely going to win H. I, I think so. I mean, I'd like to have good hopes for this. I don't see why we wouldn't. That was impressive. Ares just said nope. There's another dragon split. See, this is exactly why I choose to do when I do H. This is how I do it right here. Long splits. You can see it on this base. You can see it on Goddess Dionysus's base. This is exactly how I do it. I want those splits just like you just saw. Come on. Don't proc me. No, I want you to proc first thing on the next one. Ah, oh, Ares just demolishes that paladin. Hitting hard. H3 coming straight in. They're heading straight for the towers. I'm all right with that because Mino's going to take out all those ground troops real fast. Stop that enemy champion from proccing and we'll be okay. Perfect. Still have all the heroes. H4, easiest wave ever, especially with a completely revited up Mino just like that. This one's going to be a piece of cake because Mino's going to stop them all in their tracks right off the bat. Ready? Go. Bye-bye. Oh! That proc is just so gnarly looking. I absolutely love it. Oh, man. It looks so cool. When that when he procs, it's just... It's beautiful. I mean, just covers up... Uh, just kind of makes you shudder almost. Get him! Oh, the combo. The one-two hit from freaking... Mino and oh didn't even stand a chance that dino just went down I mean that was you you couldn't even plan that better there was no way that dino was surviving the one-two punch of Mino and Ares that was just incredible absolutely incredible wow I am so impressed with how that Ares just worked out right there there you go Kahar your very first H victory and bro I've got to tell you you are probably farming H right now if not moving on to I I bet you we could move on to I right now in fact let's give it a try we might lose miserably but hey you know I I think I might have faith in that Ares let's go we want 30 troop 30 guardians we're gonna put them in each one Come on. And I can't believe we didn't even lose any heroes in that. That was just so cool. Went from farming G to farming H and didn't even lose a hero. So, I mean, you can't get much more impressive than that. There we go. Last one. Just need 30 because we're going to go try that I. I want to see this Ares in I. Stop that spirit mage. 
Okay, so this isn't going to be the prettiest little setup you've ever seen, but I'm just going to th throw it all together real quick just to just to make it work for I, because I needs the corner base, not the H setup base. There we go. Sorry for completely fucking up your base, Kahar, but uh, I guess I can put it together when we're done. Put it back how it was for you and let you decide if you want to keep it this way or not. Um, see, we did it that way. So, yeah, this side. This side this time. Come on. Right there. Perfect. All right. So now this side. Come on, you. Get in place. Maybe if I zoom in, I could actually see what's going on. There we go. And you can go there. Perfect. Oh, there you're the one we're missing. I see now. Okay, so we now have the four corner setup for I, and we have 30 guardians in each being built at the moment. So let's go ahead and head into um, the arena. And just play around with Ares a little bit. Watch Ares just stomp on these guys. Let's go Pumpkin Duke. We definitely want Ares. We definitely want the Cupid. Uh, Mino we want. And who else would we want? Spirit Mage. One, two, three, four, five. We've got room for one more. I guess we'll go Druid. See how we do. Oh, head to head. If we get lucky, we'll get to see the proc. Come on, baby. Yeah, it's game over. If he procs, it's game over. There's no, not even a doubt in my mind about that one. He's hiding in the back of the flock, though, I see. Uh, Mino ran out ahead, but, I mean, he is ranged, too, though, so he doesn't really need to be in the front as much it's kind of like cupid it doesn't matter you know i mean if the if pumpkin duke's running ahead of cupid it's okay because cupid's still going to hit first because he's range so you could definitely throw that theory out there all right let's do another one breaking into the 800s 800s wow huge leaps when you're back this far get aries going do the same team we did before. Go oh, drop. There he is. One, two, three, four, five, six. Here we go. Wow, everybody's running top lane up here. Top 100, nobody runs top lane. Come on, Aries. Yeah. Oh, no, we lost. <laughs> 160 heroes. Yeah. Those are pretty good heroes. Let's try down below. And we'll do the same thing, I guess. Same thing, but below. Druid and Spirit Mage. See if we can get it to work. Yeah, there's quite the revite on that Mino. So he got the stun off and uh, halted our Ares from being able to proc, is what I think happened. Hopefully... This time we'll get a proc. There's the proc I was looking for. Go Spirit Mage. Ah, failure. That's all right. This isn't really an arena team that we're playing with right now, so I'm I'm okay with that. All right, check on these heroes. We got 30. We're all good. Do I even want garrisons? I'm not sure I do. Yeah, let's not do garrisons. We might lose, but that's okay. I'm not too worried about it. I just want to see how far we can get using this Ares because remember this one had never won H before never won H so this is its first time ever even seen I and we're running with it so we'll see how we do come on guys all right I just need to see some Ares proc on that spirit mage yeah the proc killed it 
but the revived spirit mage came back. But luckily, it has it didn't get a proc again, so we're okay on that. I two, here we go. Ah, oh, good stop. That's probably the best spot we could have hoped for, because now we've got all the buffer of the guardians from the other three corners. So good to go. Got pumpkin. Ah, oh, why isn't uh, the spirit mage? Oh, it's right, because it's only a certain number of heroes. But it doesn't matter, because our spirit mage walks over there and just stomps on it. We are good to go. Our pumpkin duke's procced. Bye-bye, dragons. And goodbye, copters. Yeah. I2, complete. I3, here we go. Oh, beautiful split. Oh, except for that's going to make spirit mage and thunder god proc on our town hall a couple times. Hopefully, Ares will proc on that spirit mage and... Thunder God keeping them from being able to proc on us too much because I have a feeling our Spirit Mage is going to take a hit from that Thunder God here real fast. Right there. Yep. Oh, terrible. We're going to need some see some dru Druid Hills real quick if we want to survive this. Come on, Spirit Mage. Take out that enemy Spirit Mage. Please, please, please. That was not it. And there goes our Spirit Mage. Oh, terrible. We still have a chance. We've got lots of buffers left still. And we're coming from the right side. All right. I4 coming from the good side. Druid will target that Spirit Mage first, which is real good for us because that means we're going to get some heals going. We're going to lose our Druid, though, to those dragons if we don't hurry up. Come on, somebody. Save Druid. Save Druid. Save Druid. Come on, please, please, please. Heal. Heal. Come on, Druid. Yes. We got this. We got this. Give us some heals. Yes. Whew, needed that. All right, I-5. Guys, we could be seen. Oh, my God. If this happens, wow. Wow. If we win I its first time ever after just winning H for the first time. Come on. Come on. Come on. Stay alive, Druid. Yes. Druid's still alive. I think we got this. Come on. Ares, proc. Yes. Oh, my God. Proc me no. Proc me no. Proc me no. Fuck yes. Fuck yes. Don't you dare. Oh my god, we just won I-5. First time ever trying I-5. We won I. Wow. The power of Ares right there. I mean, I know that that was probably a lot of luck, but we just fucking tanked five runs of I from the same side while losing Spirit Mage in the middle. Oh my god, I didn't even fucking talk right now. <laughs> Oh, Kahar, your account. I love it. This is so much fun. Ares is a blast. Thank you so much for letting me play with it. Dude, you can farm I now, I bet, or come damn close to farming I. I, I almost want to try J, but I want to leave you the honors for that one. So <laughs> I'm going to call this video an absolute victory right now. I'm not, I'm not going to send back. I'm going to leave the base how it is. And uh, I don't care if you have to fix your stupid base back up, bro. I just won I for you for the first time. <laughs> here you go. Here's Ares right here, guys. One more time. This hero is a beast made by my man Kahar. And I am so happy to be playing on his account and that his freaking hero won that contest. This is so freaking awesome. You have no idea. That's it for me, guys. Enjoy your night. I'm out. Bye.